Hey what is up guys, this is Kiritu here and in this video I will be discussing about a question asked among all Android users. What is rooting? What are the disadvantages and the advantages of rooting? Well, what is the simplest process to root your device? Well, let's get right into it after the intro. Yes, to begin off, I will be talking about what is rooting. So basically rooting is nothing but gaining access to the root files of a particular device. In other cases such as iOS device, it is known as jailbreaking. So similarly in Android device, Android device uh, come, may come with certain limitations from the carrier or your hardware manufacturer. Well, this rooting clears off all the limitations and gives you complete access to your device. So that is what basically rooting means. Well, as I said before, rooting clears off all the restrictions. Well, that is not liked by everyone. So the major disadvantage of rooting is it avoids your warranty. But unless you're with a cool manufacturer such as OnePlus, which they don't mind if you root your device or install custom ROMs on them, they are completely cool about it. They'll still give you warranty and support your phone. So thumbs up to OnePlus and other manufacturers what are you guys up to? So the advantages are endless. Well, the number of advantages you get by rooting your device go on. Well, sticking on to the major advantages are you can uninstall any unwanted inbuilt app which you don't like. Or maybe you can change the operating system completely. Put custom ROMs. If you're really into custom ROMs, after watching this video and rooting your device, I would recommend you guys watch the video in the description box below, which is me showing you guys how to install custom ROMs. So, continuing, getting back to the topic, uh, main advantages are endless. Everything, as I said before, it removes all limitations and you become a free user. So here we come to the most exciting part, that is rooting. The first step is head on to your browser. Once you're on your browser, type on King Root. So you don't want to download it through the Play Store. Instead, you go to the official website that is kingroot.net and then download the file so here we can find the download button and click on it and the download will start so this is a one click root process and there's also an alternative which is kingo root if this doesn't work you could try that but this is the most reliable routing method let the app take its time and install do not disturb it So now we have done downloading it, now let's install it. You want to click on install and installing. Do not interrupt the process in any moment of the routing process. Click on open. So now we are in the app, it says it's simple, it's secure and it's strong so let's click on try it now it's analyzing your device and it's found my device is Micromax A116 now it's checking whether it is uh, if either if my phone can be rooted so in this step if your phone say if it says it can't be rooted then you want to try the alternative that is Kingo root so my uh, phone says I can be rooted so I'm gonna click on the root so now my phone has started rooting 
so I just want to speed up the process your phone might uh, switch off in between do not interrupt so let me just fasten the process so now it's on 56 percentage and yes it is completed and my phone is rooted successfully now if you want to check if your phone is rooted completely you have to download an app named root checker from the app store and you'll be good to go thank you for watching guys do like and subscribe for more i'll catch you guys in the next one until then peace